Great authors, there's Dr. Spock, of course, Isaac Asimov, Dr. Seuss, and Lexington's own David Lee Jones. Yes, the local Hopefully author here. to be a doctor. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> It'd be David Lee Jones, sure. local author, and uh, you're here now. You were here a couple of months ago yes, uh, with book number one in a new trilogy. Yes, um, sir. More of our, did I say that? More, more Moria, of our Moria Verratti. Moria Verratti. Once you read the book, you understand what it means, but it's actually alien for... Well, I won't tell you that because that'll ruin it. Yeah, I don't want to spoil <laughs> it. But the cool news is you have got book number two in the series. Yes, sir. It just came out. It's called uh, Primorians. The Pyramorians. Pyramorians. It's just a uh, conglomeration of Pyramid and Morian. Pyramorians. Pyramorian, yes, sir. Now, this actually is your third book, but the second in this series. Your yes, first sir. book was The Dark Side of the Planet. Dark Side, which is a compendium of sh uh, short horror stories, which came out in 2009. Right. So what's, what's this trilogy? I know, I know you've been quite, kind of at least aligning yourself with Twilight, but uh, what's, uh, yes, what's the whole uh, the plot line? It's uh, actually uh, a science fiction horror slash thriller, and it uh, centers around a uh, geologist about 300 years in the future. Mm -hmm. His name is Brandon Jordan, and he's gone to Mars. Is he modeled Mars. after you? Are you kind of like your uh, Indiana no, Jones? No, he is kind of <laughs> like Indiana Jones in the end, but he doesn't start that way. All right. But he gets embroiled into this adventure that actually solves Eon's old mysteries on Mars, and connects to unsolved history back here on Earth. Now, the thing about wow. this book, it not only takes place in the future, but it takes place here on Earth, mm -hmm. back in the past. You kind of get this backfill in of uh, history. Is there like a DeLorean involved or any sort um, of uh, flux capacitor? I think I will. There is. Actually, there is. There is a little time <laughs> mystery going on A little time-space continuum going exactly, on? Exactly. Exactly. This I'm thing has everything. This That's book has great. everything in it, you know. And, um, it's, it, it also has an alternate timeline back in the past that centers around a, a professor, a, a college professor. Right. And uh, he finds out that humanity has been manipulated by this al a band of outcast aliens and without our knowledge. Right. And uh, he ends up running for his life from these, from these people you know, and try to uh, uh, alert you know, humanity here on Earth that, hey, we've been manipulated for eons. What's what's your uh, what's your motivation b for this book, the trilogy here? I mean, wh wh you sit at home um, late at night with a with a cold beer in your hand or something? Uh, actually, uh, I did a lot of writing when I, whenever I got off work from bartending. Right. I'd come home and write, but uh, I wrote the the story. I had the idea when I was 19. I've just mm -hmm. kind of built on it over the years. And when I got divorced, you know, about six years ago, I decided to go ahead and and get this thing done. And uh, right. actually, I have to. Um, you know, give credit to my girlfriend now, Robin Tyndall. If it weren't for her, I probably would have never made the effort to get this sure. this, this book published, these books published. That is and awesome. And she just made me believe in myself again, and here I am. That is awesome. And by the way, I just want to point out for uh, for those of you at home, <coughs> in the acknowledgments, I think there's a, there it is right there. You look down number two. Hey, Mom, I hope you're watching. Acknowledgments, Tyler Ryan. Right there. I was wondering what you were up to. <laughs> you kidding me? Look at that. He was I'm up to hijinks up here. I'm in the book, Mama. I'm in the book. <laughs> now, this He's is in a, print. This is, uh, that's right. It's probably the closest I'll ever get to being in a book, but there it is right oh, there. Oh, you're famous. What are you talking um, about? But, uh, all right, so Pyramorians. 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 I'm going to say Just it right think, next time. Pyramid Morians. Pyramorians. Book you remember, two. Remember Sesame Street? Yes, it, yes. Pyramid Morians. Pyramorians. <laughs> <laughs> Brought to you by the number 12. <laughs> there you go. Uh, 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 uh. Jones. Uh, 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 uh. This is good stuff. <laughs> We're going to get you links where you can buy these books uh, at millinsconnect.com awesome. slash GDC. And when okay. number three comes out, please come back and join us. Oh, well, I would definitely be and here. There's a whole lot of pages here. There's a 333 pages I'll be reading this weekend. So there you go. There you go. All right, man. I do Thank appreciate you, sir. <laughs> you got it, dude. Thanks for having All me. All right. Man. As always, my appreciate friend. It. Stick around. Good Day Columbia is coming right back with a whole lot more fun and some light reading as well. <laughs>